Why, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. I am 007-007-688-237 here playing East Origin. Now, this game was developed by Nihon Falco and is a prequel to the games East 1 and 2. It came out in May, and when it came out, it was on Steam sale, so I was like, whatever, let's buy it. One thing I absolutely love about this game, though, Look at all the save states, oh my god. Never gonna use them all, but it looks awesome. So, let's just start a new game. So you got choices between two characters, Unica and Hugo. Hugo is like the son of a priest, same with Unica. Except Unica doesn't have any magical abilities. Hugo, that's all he has. I, for this playthrough, am going to choose Unica because, frankly, I find Hugo is a pretty big douche. Yeah, he's just an ass all around, in my opinion. And she's just... I like Unica. And her fighting is a bit more action-packed. As you can see below, it says slow speed, mid speed. So, let's go. Difficulty level, oh, nightmare. No, no, no. And enjoy your cuts. Il avait un grand pays légendaire. Now I'm pretty sure this is in French. Quand a payé I? Sur l'intervention des dièses jumelles et des six saints, les grands pays prospéraient. Les dièses avaient un trésor précieux, la perle noire. Elle avait des sortes de pouvoirs mystérieux. Avec la magie, on pouvait faire des miracles. Avec l'éclairia, on pouvait amplifier ses pouvoirs magiques. Grâce à elle, on croyait que les pouvoirs de Is dureraient une éternité. Mais soudain, un désastre frappa Is. Beaucoup de monstres démoniques sont apparus. Et on commençait à envahir Is. Les forces diaboliques ont tout fait de ravager les terres. Mais tous les habitants sont sauvés dans la temple de Salomon. On aurait dit la fin du monde. C'est alors la perle noire qui sauva Is de la ruine. Car elle souleva les temples dans les airs. Mais, aussitôt après ces soulagements fugitifs, les démons ont construit une autre tour. Et une nuée de monstres a eu son parti en direction du sanctuaire. Is, menacé de tomber. Pire encore, un événement imperviu arriva dans le temple de Salomon. Quelle histoire! Les dias jumelles, les descendants de X ont tous disparu. Dans une situation désespérée, les six ans ont pris une résolution. Pour constituer une équipe de recherche, ils ont organisé une sélection parmi des chevaliers et des sorciers. Enfin, les sangs, ils envahiront à la terre dévastée.
is that. Alright. So there you have it. Basically, to summarize, they're just protecting shit. Demons come. City rises to the sky. Demons start trying to rise to the sky. <laughs> oh, now it's an epic title sequence. Anime style. Alrighty then. So, yeah. Basically, a lot of shit went down. <laughs> the main guy, the main guy in that was Hugo Fact, the mage, and this is the story of Unica. So those are the two goddesses, ladies Rhea and Fina. And those were the two with the blue hair in the cutscene. <coughs> and there's Unica. The girl with braids. Oof. <laughs> Tis the Deku tree. <laughs> Just kidding. Rhoda tree, the elder brother. In case you didn't guess, this is the tree talking back. Unika Tova, that was her last name. So, yeah, there you go. She can't use magic.
father right in the fields. That's a good way to keep up your hopes. That's a good sign. <laughs> so grim. That's more like it. Go get him, tiger. It is a big tower. Guess what we're gonna do? Hopefully I'm not going too fast through these. <laughs> So he's not actually dead. It's just suppressing her magic that she never had, I guess. I don't know. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> I do quite like the art style of this game, though. It's very nice, very nice. Another cutscene. But it is true. Tower entrance. Huzzah. Sounds like something's going down. Ho-ho! Speaking of which... Dino! Eolia! By the way, they are saying father as a priest. <laughs> Just to make sure. <laughs> Alright, so these are the basic controls. It's kind of awkward having the attack key as the Z key because it's. I mean, it just doesn't feel right 
because it, I don't know, you you end up just mashing the attack and it's using your pinky, so it's not the strongest finger with the most stamina. <laughs> so I just rebound everything opposite, like V is attack, C is to jump, X is skill, and shit, and all that stuff. So yeah, there's a bunch of different moves which are pretty fun. So let's get going. Yay! They did. Aww. What is boost mode, and how is it used? All right. I haven't really read up what his beast boost mode is. Only half damage. Ah, oh, so she. It doesn't really affect her. Hugo's boost mode, like his normal mode, he has like two flying eyes or whatever, spheres, balls of fact or whatever they're called, and they basically, uh, when he activates boost mode, they turn into five of them, and it's pretty handy. But I guess this one only changes the magic points used. And damage received. Nicely done. Father Superior. Hell no, Dino. Acolyte of Solomon Shrine. Oh, Dino's a guy. <laughs> See, Unique is just so nice. Like, Hugo's just a stuck up son of a bitch. Ha, <laughs> ha. Clean. So sad. Oh, I see. That's what you saw in the cutscene, that guy firing out those tentacle looking things. It sort of disrupted the transport cell spell. Yeah, so everyone was scattered. <laughs> what do you know? Again, as seen in the cutscene. It's nice that we don't have to <laughs> see it ourselves. That is true. There are some pretty big enemies in this. <laughs> you look funny. Not too far away or anything. Ha! <laughs> hmm. I 
No, I am. Sir Galleon. We'll meet him later. So very, very much. Yes. The crystal. It's very handy. Uses are explained. <laughs> How very twisted. The crystal's power purified the demon statue. It's physically impossible. I don't know why they bring it here. I would gather them all up in one area and then just store them. <laughs> Considering what they can do. Thus the crystal. Oh, I get it. Thus the crystal. Okay. <laughs> A portable blessing indeed. Yes, it does. Very handy ability there. Haha, <laughs> because she has no magic. <laughs> all the gifts today. Except this is a fucking conch shell. Stupid. Eh, it doesn't really have much use. <laughs> You can count on me. We're all in this. <laughs> uh, high school musical. That was terrible. <laughs> yeah, the crystal is very handy. Like, if you're in a room and you just swarmed, you're down to 1 HP or whatever, you just use the crystal, and then it's just instant teleport to a statue and that heals you immediately. Only problem is, the rooms respawn, so if you did get far and then just like, ah shit, you pretty much have to leave. Alright, so now we're running around with uh, Unica Tova. And I think I'm probably going to end this episode here. So that was the intro. What will we do next? Oh yeah, and if you haven't guessed already, this entire game is based in this tower. You're basically going up the levels, one by one, and getting everything. So until next time, this has been 007 007 Have a nice day.